so the product line as it stands right now, we're looking at what, 32 to 48 feet. Uh, I understand standing up to new products on the drawing board. Um, any of those you'd like to share with us? Some of the yeah, new yeah, it's, it's gonna be quite a, uh, a late 2020 and 2021 and 2022 is um, exciting times for Aquila. Um, we've been really busy working the last couple of years on a couple of pretty cool boats. Um, we're gonna, our, our queen of the sh fleet is gonna be our new Aquila 70. Oh. Um, should, should be launching her pretty soon. And uh, interesting boat because we did a lot of uh, research before we um, actually uh, started designing the boat. So it was extensive studies quite a few years ago. Um, and again, it's a boat that's really going to step into a, into a really cool place in the market. Um, and, you know, very, very good looking, um, decent, decent turn of speed. Um, and then, so the Kilo 70 is going to be just something absolutely fantastic and a lot of, lot of really cool innovation on that boat. Then the Kilo 54, which is uh, also going to be out later this year so um, we're targeting Fort Lauderdale to show both the Aquila 70 and the Aquila 54 so that's uh, that's Very pretty good. big for a little you know <laughs> a, 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 a new relatively new brand and then we're um, yeah we're working on some center consoles we're working on some um, ribs as well so what we'll we've developed on the Aquila 70 so I can talk about a, a 14 foot catamaran rib that slips right up between the holes so that's what, another innovation feature but you know we've sort of been saying all along is uh you know we believe in cats that everybody has a minor hole uh rib yeah and the same the same things is you know well a cat's going to be more stable it's uh, going to give you more space so, so we're going to have our little aquila range of uh ribs um so yeah it's going to be i mean we we've got a lot of new product that is almost ready to hit the water and a lot on the drawing boards as well. Uh, a lot of ambitious product development. Uh, ribs uh, all the way up to 70, the 54. Mm -hmm. Do you see anyone else in the industry as aggressive as that? Um, anyone else creating that many new models? No, I don't believe there's very many. Well, certainly not in the catamaran market. I think most of our competitors are sitting pretty much with a niche within a niche. Um, you know they 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 don't um we're sort of really expanding across but the only reason that we can really do that again and I, i'll say it again is is that we have the best distribution in the world um and you know you just couldn't do that without knowing that we've got the ability to sell the boats um we've also got you know under dave biggie's guidance and we've got a great guy yvonne emu who's out in thailand we've been building the international distribution as well and we've got some you know they've done an incredible job for a keeler out there as well and um you know they also need more product um so to get more dealers and, and the, inch, the cool thing is that we're really seeing um and and i take my hat off to dave and yvonne for this is the um the type of dealers that we're starting to attract are sort of the more high-end um luxury they already carry luxury brands so they're not the dealers that are sort of dealing with the, you know, the sort of more mainstream product, but really the more high end. And, and, and that, that, that tells a lot, you know, that tells a lot when you've been around a while and sure. the type of dealers sure. that are, are calling and saying, Hey, we want your brand. Right. They, so, they're, they're coming after you, right? <laughs> yes. And, and that, uh, so, so that's a cool position to be in. And, uh, and, and we're so, very happy about that. It sounds like you have, some really great product, some really great product under development, and a dealer network to help support the sales of those products.